What is going on everyone? My name is Toon Mike and today we're going to be playing Smashing 4. Before we get started into today's video, I want to say thank you so much for your continued support. I say this every day, but it's because I mean it every day. There's no other way to thank you guys without obviously saying thank you. I wish I could do more, but the only thing I could do is just say thank you every day for your continued support, for subscribing to my channel, for watching my videos. And just, yeah, just just continue to support me. It really means a lot. So thank you so much. So we're, we're going to be playing Smashing 4. I actually received a YouTube comment about uh, five or six hours ago from when I post this video about a new challenge that, that they want me to do. And they recommended me this. The Paladin, the Rocketeer, the Blacksmith, and the Wraith. This is going to be very interesting. I kind of know what to do when it comes to this deck. Obviously, you, you, I just need to overpower the Rocketeer and then just cause some shenanigans and hopefully we'll, we'll win some matches. Uh, but yeah, we're going to be able to, we're going to do that. And uh, oh, look at this. Like we are 13, 13 cards away from maxing out the Berserker. Whenever we get the Berserker to max, we're probably going to switch out the Naga to the Berserker from my main, from my main deck. And hopefully that's going to be an insane, Hopefully we can get to 4,000 with that deck, but we're not, we're not going to do that today. We're going to be playing in the challenge, in the challenge, in the, not the classic challenge, nope. We're going to start fresh in the Majestic challenge, so let's just jump in and hope for the best. Um, <clears throat> excuse me, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a little, I'm not, I don't think I'm sick, but I've been sneezing a lot lately, so maybe I'm sick, but uh... I've been loving doing this this types of videos where you guys recommend me decks and uh, just just go ham with the decks. So uh, if you guys have any um, any other deck recommendations that you guys want me to do, by all means, please let me know. Let me know, and I'll definitely do them. Um, it's been so much fun doing doing your guys' decks. So we're gonna do this. We're also buffed up the uh, the Rocketeer once, so that's good. Um, and everybody's got a defen be defense buff. Sorry, I cannot speak, but that's me in, in every single video. <laughs> so we're gonna, unfortunately, uh, they might take a lot of damage here, to be honest with you. So, unless I do something with the, with the assassin. So we're gonna hopefully make the assassin move. And we were able to heal up the blacksmith and the rocketeer, making the rocketeer buffed up once more. So now the Rocketeer is gonna be is it's its turn, so it's probably gonna do what is it 185 damage? 190 damage? Something like that. Almost 200 damage. Okay, so I just received 100 damage right there. Yeah, it's about 180 something. Unfortunately, I cannot hit both of uh, two troops at the, at the same time. So we're gonna hit the uh, hit the assassin like this, and hopefully we can kill it off whenever the assassin bounces. Bada bing, bada boom. Nope. We did hit the uh, we did we did hit him towards the paladin, but now I, it's probably gonna be death for the paladin and also the blacksmith. Let's see. Close, very 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 close. So we're gonna. I would like to hit. Yeah. So we're gonna do that. Slightly touch the assassin. Can can we also hit the uh, blaze as well at the same time? Yes. Yes, we can. So let's do this. Bada bing, bada boom. We also hit the the Rocketeer plus the Treant and buffed up the Wraith with defense. So, so far we are doing okay. We need to keep the Rocketeer alive or else we're going to have to rely on the Wraith to take out everybody. Ooh, that's actually it for the Blacksmith. That's sad. Okay. That is sad. So we're going to have to... Yes, we'll hit the Rocketeer. We should be able to hit Blaze. Hopefully we can hit the Rocketeer twice. Hopefully. We did. And the Blaze is... Well, Blaze is not blocked. But uh, we were able to hit the Rocketeer twice. So I think it's it's again doing... No, actually it's doing about 200 da uh, 250 damage now. Never... Never mind, it's still alive. Luckily it is still alive. So we're gonna... We're gonna hit Blaze. Blaze is just too powerful. I would I would hit the mice bandit, but Blaze is just causing a lot of problems when it comes to just with that with that uh, fire damage that it's doing. So now it's up to mm, if it kills my paladin, we're gonna be in trouble. Okay, not bad, not bad actually. That was okay. Um, so we need to. We're probably not gonna be able to. 
Actually, let me see how much health does my Rocketeer have. 45 and 3 and it's doing how much? 56, yeah. So it's, it really doesn't matter. So let's just try to do damage to, I guess, the Mice Bandit. The Mice Bandit is just is a deadly card. So let's do this. But I mean, he surrendered? Why? Dude, you were doing so... You... We take those. We take those. I have no idea why he surrendered. He was... He had the advantage, in my opinion. He was he was gonna beat me. Oh well, let's jump into another one. That was... I'll take that win. I'll take that win. Okay, so here's a very famous meta deck. Very famous. I think... I think he has an Ice Queen for variation. So, that's actually pretty interesting. So, let's see if we can... Hmm. Actually, this, I guess let's just hit the Rocketeer. Hopefully, we can touch it twice. Yes, three times. We also, we also did damage to the to the Ice Queen. That was pretty impressive. And we can actually deal damage to the Sentinel and the Sorceress at the same time. Yeah, we should be able to hit both of them easily. Yeah, that's a lot of damage. It's a lot of damage. So, let's hit both of them. Maximize damage as much as you can. Plus, we also be we were also able to hit the Sentinel with the Paladin as well for 51 damage. So that we're doing pretty good, pretty good. So he's now he's gonna use the Sentinel's ability that actually did a pr a decent amount of damage, and of course the Ice Queen's ability. So let's do this. Let's buff up the Wraith with um with defense, and we should be able to hit the Rocketeer plenty of times. Like that's that's at least three or four times. That's at least three or four times. So the Rocketeer should be a monster right now. Pretty good deck, guys. I I can see why this deck is also pretty good. If you guys used them in the in the challenge, let me know if this deck actually got you to twelve wins because this deck it seems really good. So let me I guess hit the hit the Rocketeer again. We also did damage to the to the Golem. The whole point is just, is just to buff up the Rocketeer and just go crazy with them. And hopefully they'll hopefully my opponent makes them makes the, the troops stick together so that the Rocketeer can just hit them all in one shot. What you gonna do? Okay, decent amount of damage. That was a decent amount of damage. A little bit scary right there. Um I can't unfortunately I cannot heal the Rocketeer. I really want to do so, but I can't. So we're gonna do this, we- oh, never mind, we actually healed up the Rocketeer, so now the Rocketeer should be able to survive just a turn longer. I mean, it is a Sentinel's turn, the Sentinel cannot do much. That was actually a pretty good amount of damage, but we should be able to kill both of these guys now? Can we? Yeah, that's actually death, that's actually crazy. And we also dealt damage to the Sorceress thanks to the Rocketeer knockback. So now it's just the Sentinel's turn. However, he the Sentinel is actually never mind. He surrendered. Never mind. Sorry, I'm looking away. I'm, I'm looking at my computer. So wow, two wins in a row. That's actually well, not impressive, but it's better. It's a better start than my last Smashing Four video. This this deck is really good. Can we make it to twelve wins? This is I'm. I don't want to. I don't want to sound conf uh, confident, but I think we can do it with this deck. I think we can. So up against Pro. Okay. Okay, this is a little dangerous right now. We are in a little bit of dangerous ter territory, and unfortunately, unfortunately, um. Oh, did I miss? Nope, I did not miss. Unfortunately, the Rocketeer started first, so. Not the greatest starting hand. You obviously don't want to start the Rocketeer first. You would like him to go last. Makes sense, right? Um, hopefully, uh, unfortunately, he uh, enchanted the Wraith, which is fine. Let's uh, let's actually do this. We should be able to power up the Wraith. I was that was either twice or three times. I I couldn't tell if that was twice or three times. Uh, it is now the blacksmith's turn, so now we can give them damage buff. Okay, he was only able to heal up or hit the wraith once, which is not bad. Can we hit? Yeah, we should. We should be able to hit the assassin and then uh, give those two uh, defense buff. Bada bing, bada boom. 
we were, we also healed up the uh, what was it the uh, the paladin or the, or the rocketeer? Sorry, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a little off today, but I wanted to do a video for you guys. I was actually gonna do a Cla uh, Clash Royale video, but but then one of you guys uh, suggested this deck. I'm like I I gotta do this. I gotta do the deck for them. I got to. And I mean, I gotta do the video for them. And so here we are. I hope you guys enjoy it, even though I may sound a little bit off. I was actually gonna do this with uh, without the face cam, but I was like, nah, let me let me show my face. Let me interact with you guys a little bit better, shall we? So here we are. So um, it is the giant's turn. He's gonna use some naga to hit the uh, the blacksmith, killing the blacksmith with the with the giant's ability. Lucky, lucky, lucky. Um, we we might be able to hit. All three of these guys, yeah? Yeah, we should. Let's do this. Bada bing, bada boom. Is that, is that giant dead too? The giant survives. But we did take out the Naga and the Assassin, which which were dangerous because Assassin is just too strong still. And Okay, the Wraith is dead. That's fine. And the Naga with, uh, with the ability to pretty much just go crazy when it comes to enchantments. Uh, actually, he'll survive, so let's just take out the giant already? Or should we just go for the sorceress? I guess we'll deal damage to the sorceress. The sorceress is still alive. Oops, sorry about that. Didn't mean to move my camera that much. The sorceress is still alive. Um, if they're, if they're together, yeah, they are together. How much health do they have? Yeah, that's it. That's oh, never mind. The black, the paladin is actually blocking my shot, but we should be able to hit both of them regardless. Bada bing, bada boom. Oh, never mind. The same. Oh, never mind. The giant is still alive. I thought the steam was was gonna be enough. It's not. Steam does ten percent of their max health, right? I think it does. Anyway, regardless, we won. The next shot should be enough to take out the giant. The giant should only have like eight health. So, yep, it does have a health. So there you go, guys. That's another win. We are 3-0. and Pretty good. Pretty good. Um, um, once again, uh, please let me know down, down in the comments below what other challenge decks would you like me to do. It could be meta. It could be a wacky deck. Uh, just let me know down in the comments below. Like I said, this is very, very fun for me. I like to be able to speak with you guys uh, through comments. So being able to do this, actually, it's it, it's a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun for me to do this with you guys. So we mm, we might to we might run to, into some problems here. To be honest with you, he did miss the he did miss the satyr. So I'm happy with that. And also, should we? Okay, so let's hit the the rocketeer twice. Bada bing, bada boom. Plus, we got a speed buff. We were. We were able to hit the sorceress and the enchantress. Okay, so that's good. And now the rocketeer has. We'll be able to deal with 185 damage, which is pretty good. 185 damage. Am I able to hit both of these guys uh, at the same time? Yes, okay. As long as you can hit multiple troops at once with the rocketeer, you have a decent chance. However, um. Him enchanting three of my troops already right off the bat, it is a little bit of a problem. Uh, so let's heal up both of these guys. Hopefully, we can hit the Rocketeer twice. We should be able to hit the Wraith twice. Yes, yes. So there you go. So the Rocketeer got hit twice. So now it's doing 195 damage. I keep forgetting the number. So it's doing 60, 65 times 3. So now it's 195. Sorry if my math is off. I think it is 195. So we have to heal up the, the Rocketeer if we can. So let's do this. We failed to hit to... We failed. I try my best to heal up the Rocketeer. But that's actually probably going to be death to the Rocketeer. So because of all the fire that's going to happen right there. Yep. Ooh, My Blacksmith is also dead too. Great. So it's the Wraith's turn, so we should be able to take out the Seder, maybe? And maybe Blaze at the same time, too. Plus healing up the... Healing up the Wraith. Yeah. Oh. Can we hit Wraith? 
Uh, ooh, okay, so we miscalculated a little bit. We were, we only hit the uh, blaze twice, but we did kill off the satyr. Satyr was doing an uh, insane amount of damage. As long as we can keep, ooh, okay. As long as we can keep the wraith alive, we should be fine. And we should be okay by doing this. We should be able to heal up the wraith at least twice. Plus seeing, dealing a lot of damage to the, uh, to the sorceress, that was actually pretty decent. So the so the paladin is gonna die. Oh, is she? Or is he? Sorry. He actually kept the paladin alive. That's actually very interesting. Very interesting. So let's. Let's see. We we will like Blaze dead. We need him dead. But we might be able to hit the in, the enchantress as well, right? We might be able to hit the Enchantress. Yes, we did. Oh, almost hitting. Almost hitting the... The Sorceress. I don't think it was going to be enough to, to kill it. Nope. And I think that's death. <gasps> she missed. She missed the Paladin just by a hair. How much? A hundred. The Paladin is doing 51 per hit. So if we hit her twice, that's it. That's GG. Come on, do not miss. Do not mess up. Do not choke. And that should be good. Yes, we actually hit her three times. Wow, that was lucky. That fatal mis- well, it wasn't a fatal mistake, it was very difficult to plan. But look at that, guys, we are four in a- four in a row? We won four in a row, sorry. Can't speak, I'm trying, I'm trying. <laughs> but we are four and zero, guys. We already have my goal, you could say. Because 2400 gold and 186 cards is actually pretty decent for 100 gems in my opinion. So we're doing pretty good. We are actually very, doing really well. No losses yet. So he's gonna use the Sorceress ability immediately. Right off the bat. Enchanting everybody. Okay, I have to give him well played. That was very good. I have to give him the, the props. That was very well played. So we should be able to hit it towards the blacksmith and... Maybe the Wraith? Nope, just the... Just the Wraith. It's all good. Unfortunately, everybody's enchanted, so he... He had an amazing start. So that's gonna be a lot of damage regardless. So much damage. So let's do this. Let's re-enchant the Wraith. Plus deal damage to these two. And we should be able to hit the Rocketeer. Oh, yeah, that was a hit. And we killed off the, the Sorceress, so... We killed off the Sorceress and we re enchanted the Wraith with extra defense, so we are okay. Now we just need to heal up the, the Wraith a little bit. Oh, the Blacksmith is dead. Oh, okay. Blacksmith is dead. Not what I wanna... Not what I, not what I want, to be honest with you. Honestly, I don't know what to do. I think this is a loss for us. Uh, we might be able to hit the, the Rocketeer by uh, by doing this, to heal him up. We missed. And we also failed to, to heal up the Wraith. Okay, that was a big misplay on my part. I tried. So yeah, this is going to be our first loss, but hey, we did pretty good. Pretty good. I gotta, I gotta admit, that was a pretty good play. This guy, this guy has a very decent deck as well. I can see the combos that this guy can do. Uh... Yeah, we can hit three of these guys. Bada bing, bada boom. Plus a hit on the on the ice queen with the wraith. Thank you very much. And that should be maybe that should be no, that's not death. Yeah, that's not death yet. Ooh, okay, okay. Uh, now it should be death. Yeah, because it is the ice queen's turn, and we can't do much. So we're just gonna have to. Just do this, I guess. Yeah, just do that. Bada bing, bada boom. Oh, double hit. Whoa, that was impressive. Double hit on those guys. Did not plan that. Did not plan that. So I'm happy that I made that play, but regardless, we already lost. It should be GG. Oh, is that enough? The tremor? The Ah, oh, yeah, the Ice Queen's ability. Yeah, I totally forgot about that. I don't know why. I don't know why I forgot about that. Well, that, that's our first loss. That was a pretty good, pretty good run, pretty good win streak until that. He had a very good deck. Let's just jump into another one. We should be able. To, we should be fine. 
at least six wins. I would like six wins now, just be halfway there. Can I pronounce your name? Can I even read your name? Oh gosh. Uh, okay, so we are facing, oof, okay, Blaze again, Sorceress again, so let's do this. So let's enchant the Wraith, plus hitting the Rocketeer like so. Bada bing bada boom, bada bing bada boom. Oh, I think I only hit the, the, uh, the Rocketeer once. If, I would, if we would have hit him twice, do, it would have done 195 damage, so... A little, a little bit of a misplay, but hey, at least he's doing 130 instead of doing 65. So hopefully they get grouped up together. Yeah, they, they got they got grouped up together there, over there. So let's steal damage over here. Plus, the Wraith should be able to do... Yep, there you go. A lot of damage to the Wizard. That was 138 damage to the Wizard, and I did not plan that either. So we are sitting pretty good so, so far. Only the Wraith is enchanted. Oof, okay, that was that was a little bit bad. So let's actually buff up these two with defense, because I do not want them taking too much damage. And the Rocketeer actually got hit twice, so that's actually really good. Really good. Oof, okay, but the Blaze is gonna do the burn. Oof, oof, okay. Got multiple burns, actually. So let's actually heal up the Rocketeer. We should be able to do... Oh, multiple heals on the Rocketeer. And maybe even the Wraith. Let's see. Bada bing, bada boom. Plus the Rocketeer did, did damage to the to the wizard. That was actually pretty impressive. And the, the Rocketeer is actually max uh, max health now. Thank you for the Paladin. Oh. Ye is the wizard dead? Not the, res the, the Wraith. Yeah, the Wraith is dead. Um, unfortunately... The wizard is... Never mind. The wizard is not blocking. Yeah, we need to take out those two. I don't care about the wizard so, for now. But we have to take out those two. Somehow I made the paladin heal up the blacksmith. That was very good. Uh, it is Blaze's turn. Yeah, it's actually going to do a lot of damage to three of them. Yeah, that was a lot of damage. Oh, okay. Let's make sure that we have enough damage for him to be uh, for the rocketeer to be able to do so so there you go plus that was actually almost death for the wizard unfortunately the wizard is gonna do a lot of damage here and the wizard is dead isn't he not the wizard oh my gosh i cannot i cannot say names either the the blacksmith is dead so let's actually heal up the the rocketeer hopefully we can touch him twice bada beam bada boom failed but we did damage to, to the blaze that was really good any damage is good damage, however, that's gonna be... Oh no! I should've, I should've done direct damage to them. We might... No, 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 I think we lost this one. Plus that fire is gonna, it's gonna be too much. Yeah, we lost. I don't, I shouldn't have gone for, for the Rocketeer, man. I shouldn't have. That was a big misplay. I thought, I, I thought we were gonna do well. And we were doing well, and then I just made a big misplay. But hey, this is fine. We are 4-2. Hopefully we can we can win one more game or two games. Oh, what's, what's going on with the game? Why can't I... Okay, I was about to say, why was why why, why what the game wasn't letting me hit continue? So let's jump into... Hopefully it's not one more match. Ho hopefully we can win a couple of more. So we are facing... Ooh, okay, so he has a little bit of healing cap capabilities. So let's actually do this. Do not deal damage. Buff up. There you go, that's about at least three hits. Three touches to the Rocketeer. So let's see, what is he gonna do? So he's gonna hit both of them. Hitting the Wraith twice, yep. So he hit the, hit the Wraith twice. So now let's, uh, instead of hitting the Rocketeer, let's actually... Give them a defense buff. Bada bing, bada boom. And a hit. Yeah, we actually get, got a hit on the on the warrior there. That was pretty good. Uh, now let's buff up the the rocketeer. Oh, never mind. She is blocking me. But we can still we can still do it though. Yeah, we can still do it. Let's buff up the rocketeer like this, and maybe we can hit some people. Yep, we actually hit the. Uh, 
we actually hit the warrior. Sorry, I can't. I I'm I'm having trouble fi uh, remembering names for some reason. So, oh, please join them. Please join them. Oh, I I think it's out of range. Yeah, it is out of range. Wow, but we can actually kill the we can kill the vampire right there. Yeah, he surrendered. He knows it. That was so good. That was so good. So that was a quick win. Hopefully we can win one more so we can get to six wins. And uh, hopefully we can continue on from there so we can get the good rewards. I do want Berserker so we can max him out, but we'll see. I only, I just only need 13. But obviously today is a Monday, for or whenever I post this video, so the when you request cards, you can request epics. So I'm going for Shaman to tell Berserkers right now. So let's actually hit the Rocketeer like this and buff up both of them. Both him and the Wraith. Okay, not bad. Hopefully he doesn't get too much fire damage. That fire damage is really strong. Ouch! Is the blacksmith dead? Wow, he is dead. Okay. Well, at least I was able to defense buff the... Uh, um, the Rocketeer and the Wraith. Because, oh my gosh. So let's do that. And both of them actually touched the fire, so that was really good. We also did damage to the Enchantress. It's a, the Wraith should not be dead. Oh, almost dead. So let's actually heal him up, because that's a lot of damage. I had to make I had to make a cut over there, guys. I'm sorry. I, I just received a phone call mid-game. But uh, it's nothing important. So we're, we're still here. We're still in the match. Uh, so we're gonna do this. We should be able to hit them four times, maybe. One. Uh, nope, only hit them twice. I made a mistake right there as well. But we should be able... We should be able to make a comeback here. S sorry if you heard a uh, vibration. That's probably a voicemail from the person that just called me. But yeah, we can hit four of these guys, or three of these guys, sorry, and the wish it should die as well because it's supposed to touch the fire. There you go, and that was the damage too to the blaze. Okay, yeah, this is GG. This is GG. GG's. This person should not be able to make a comeback. Oh, don't you dare. Oh, 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 okay. Okie doke. It should be enough to kill one hit. Should. Yeah, it is. Have a taste of your own medicine. Touch the fire. Nope, I missed the fire. But hey, there you go, guys. There, that's another one right there. That's we're doing pretty good. Pretty good. My best, uh, my best uh, score that I got on uh, on video for you guys. It is eight wins, I think. With the uh, which deck I used, I got to to eight wins. I honestly don't remember. Can I hit continue? So let me hit continue. What's going on with this game? There you go. There it is. So we got six wins now. We are halfway there. Oh, however, we if we only lose once, uh, our one our run will land. But hey, we have already. Uh, we're gonna win a decent amount of golden cards. So hey, we're 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 sitting pretty. Hopefully, we get some berserkers out of that too. Mm. And okay. Oh, sorry about that. Let me move out of there. That was a voicemail again. Whoa! What was that glitch? Okay, wait, what is happening? The game is glitching. Okay. Okay, that was strange, but okay. That was super strange. Um, so let's actually... Let's hit both of these guys, and we should be able to buff up the Rocketeer once or twice. So let's do this. Bada bing. Just once, and I keep... I keep miscalculating. I keep miscalculating. Like I should have been able, I should have been able to hit Blaze four times. Actually, I was I was only able to hit once. So I keep making those mistakes that could potentially cost me the game. He is actually trying to use the Blaze to deal damage, and he failed miserably. Thank you for that. So we're we're gonna hit both of you because why not? That's actually gonna be a decent amount of damage. We also dealt burn damage to the Warlord twice, to be in fact. And now the Warlord buffed himself up again. 
Oh, not himself again. He buffed himself up this time, but it's a Blaze's turn. So, but it looks like he's trying to use the the buff, and it worked pretty well. Worked pretty well. So let's actually give a de defense buff to the to the Paladin and hopefully the Rocketeer and maybe even the Wraith. No, we were able to do so to. Oh my gosh. Do you guys agree that sometimes when the troop is supposed to stop, but it stops onto the Wraith, giving them that little speed, like, unfair? Sometimes it is unfair because I shouldn't have done all- I shouldn't have done any of those things that happened. But since the troops literally stopped right next to the Wraith, they literally gave them a, a- you could say a speed buff, because they cannot stop next to the Wraith. Hence, um... Just given the extra movement. Hence, dealt damage. In my opinion, it shouldn't do that. It should not do that because that little that little movement speed, it can potentially be a uh, uh, game changer. And that was probably game changer for me. This guy got lucky getting the Wraith uh, buffed with extra damage. He got lucky. We do need the Wraith out of there. Yep. Oh, do not touch my Wraith. Do not touch my Wraith. You... Really? You got so lucky, dude. You got so lucky. Is it one head and you're done? No? Mm, so let's do this. We'll only be able to heal up the Wraith once, I think. But, but hey, that's, that's okay. And we also dealt damage with fire. See, it stopped right there. But the other troops, I guess it's Wraith and Wraith, so it doesn't matter, but still, that was... That was a lot of damage, the thing that happened with, with my Wraith. So, yeah, I think this is GG, unfortunately. Like, I would need to do a lot of damage with the Wraith somehow, and I don't think we're gonna be able to do so. Especially because my Wraith might... It's not the Wraith's turn. It's the Blacksmith's turn. So, we're gonna do this. Hopefully we can hit the tree and twice, hit the warlord once. Nope. Actually we did. Somehow we did. Okay, this is a warlord's turn uh buffed, but he is probably gonna yeah. So he is probably gonna hit the Wraith, sadly. Maybe. Please don't hit the Wraith. Don't hit the Wraith. He misses the Wraith just by a hair. Um whew. I don't know what to do here, to be honest with you. We can... It should be enough to... Like, let me do math real quick. Let's do this. Yep, it, it is enough to kill him. So let's hit him twice. And then we should be able to deal damage. Yep, there you go. We dealt damage to the Treant. We are still alive. I miscalculated. How much health does he have? 11 health. Okay, so I miscalculated. <sighs> I thought he was dead. I definitely miscalculated my math there. Uh... Oh my gosh. Okay. Hmm. What can I do here? We have to take out the Warlord because that damage buff is deadly. So let's do this. Hopefully we can hit the tree at least twice. Once, twice. Okay. Ah, but the position that I'm in, yeah, that's it. That's if I was at a, if I was at an awkward angle so that, that he cannot hit me twice, I would have probably been good. But instead, he's gonna kill me. Yep, he killed me. Ah, oh, man. That was close. That was a close game. I'm sorry. I'm sorry that I sound a little off. I, I'm just tired. But then again, I'm always tired. And who is not tired? But, hey, six wins. That's pretty good. Better than my last one. That was six wins. Let's claim the rewards. Hopefully we get Berserkers. And some zombies. Berserkers. Berserkers. I don't need that. Berserkers. Nope. Zombies. Nope. Zombies. No. How about shamans? Nope. Of course, not getting the card that I want. Well, that was pretty interesting. <laughs> well, guys, uh, let me know down in the comments below what challenge deck do you want me to use, and I'll certainly do it either tomorrow or Wednesday. But guys, thanks, uh, thank you so much for watching this video. And if you guys like the video, uh, please make uh, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more Smashing 4 videos. Uh, yeah, like I said, just let me know in the, uh, down in the comments uh, what challenge deck would you like me to do, and I'll certainly do it either tomorrow or Wednesday. Uh, this, I actually, I really love doing this. I love doing this for you guys. So please let me know. 
and I'll certainly do it for you guys. Well guys, thanks again for watching this video and I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care.